Hello, we are going to be looking at functions today. Uh, functions are a way of writing one line of code, such as menu brackets, uh, which then runs a hell of a lot more code behind it. And it's really, really useful for making sure that you avoid code repetition. Code repetition could lead to many things happening, such as incorrect uh, spellings of variables. Uh, it could lead to logical errors, could lead to syntax errors, because you have to keep rewriting the code. Whereas if you use a function, all you need to do is write it once to use it and then write it once for the actual code you want to use. So in this example, we are going to be creating a menu. The menu is nice and easy and simple to understand. So let's have a look at it. First line of code here creates a variable and just make sure that's empty. And then we have a large series of print lines. And what this will do is this will display to the user the menu system they're going to see. So we can see it's going to say, welcome to the Lego set. We're going to have a line which is made from a load of equal signs and then four different options. We can then have choice is equal to an input. So the user is asked, can enter a number? And then the number they enter becomes the variable choice. And then we have a series of if statements. So if the choice is equal to one, you're going to load up another function which you've not correct, created yet called set Lego. If choice is equal to two, display Lego. Choice is equal to three, run export. And if choice equals four, we're going to raise system exit. And what that does is it just stops the program. Else, it runs the menu again. So choice is always going to be the value which gets input in. And remember when you're writing this to make sure you spell choice correctly all the way through. So if we just run this code, we can see here, welcome to the Lego sorter. If we press four, it quits it, it stops it, we go back to the shell. But if we press um, another button, so for example two, it says display Lego is not defined because we've not created it. So let's create it now. So we are gonna go def menu. No, we're not, we're gonna go to, sorry about that. We're gonna go to def display lego brackets and what these brackets are for if you want to pass in any parameters or use any other pieces of data they go into here and they're very useful which you're going to look at in a future video and all we're going to do for here is print you have selected the display lego give it a capital l lego function and we're going to save it and i'm going to press f5 and now we're going to ask for it to display lego we've displayed lego function fantastic so there are different things that you can do with this code. You could make the if statements more robust. You could add definite, uh, you could define the functions. Many, many things that you can do. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Feel free to leave them feedback. Thank you. Bye-bye.